I'm going to do the complete history of the Old Testament in 20 minutes by Paul Mess Long. Uh, a version of five minutes by Caleb Kirkman. <laughs> 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 All right, um, I'll, I have this calls for uh, movement, so I'm going to work right here. So, you <laughs> Can you hear me without the mic? Yes. Okay, I just wanted to make sure. Now the serpent was craftier than any of the beasts the Lord had made. Don't just try it. Once isn't going to hurt you. Get with it, it is the Middle Ages. Hey, Eve, Eve. Oh, oh, isn't that the stuff we're not supposed to eat? Well, everyone else is doing it. Hey, who else is here besides you and me? You never like anything I fix. Adam, Adam, where are you? Because you ate what I forbade you not to eat, dust you are, and to dust you shall return. Man evicted from his place, no trespassing, but by grace. The final days are spent in pain, weeding thistles, raising Cain. Cain's a farmer, Abel's not. Abel's favored, Cain gets hot. Man's first sibling rivalry. In the murder, first degree. <laughs> Abraham, Abraham, where are you? You mean me? <laughs> I have chosen you, Abraham, to be the patriarch of my people. Hey, that sounds fantastic. <laughs> What's a patriarch? <laughs> <laughs> I have chosen you to be the forefather of my people, Abraham. Excuse me. Oh, I hate to complain, but the name's Abram. There's no hand in it. It's not kosher, remember? <laughs> <laughs> From this day forth, you shall be called Abraham, the father of many. And I shall make a covenant with you. First, you shall have a real finance on your own. Real estate. That's good. <laughs> Second, I'll multiply your descendants as the stars in the sky. And third, I will bless you so that through you, all nations will bless themselves. Excuse me, did he say we're going to have a son? <laughs> I'll be 106 before he gets his license. And believe me, no one over 100 should be the parent of a teenager. <laughs> hey, mom. Hey, dad. My son! Where did he come from? <laughs> 2,000 years and 20 minutes. You don't have time for the details. <laughs> hey, uh, I have a family to start in two chapters. Can we get the whole human sacrifice out of the way? Sure. You get the wood, I'll get the knife. I think I missed something. <laughs> Abraham, late in life, wants his son to find a wife. He sends his servant on a ride. You find my boy a hometown ride. <laughs> At a well, drawing water, and Rebecca, Bethy will solder. She agrees to relocate, and with Isaac, sends a date. She has twin rival brothers. One his dad's boy, and one his mother's. Harry Esau's the older, while quiet Jacob's the bolder. Now the time came that Abraham, I mean God, sorry, renewed his covenant with Abraham and Isaac, and the sons of Jacob, number 12. <coughs> Now Jacob loved Joseph more than any of his children. But when Joseph, Joseph's brothers learned that their father loved him more, they hated him. You sniveling old brown noser, we should sell you to a hairy Ishmaelite. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm hairy Ishmaelite. Look for Hebrew slippers. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I could use. Sure. Excuse me, oh, I'm a wealthy Egyptian looking for a Hebrew slave from a hairy Ishmaelite. Got anything I could use? Sure. Excuse me, I'm the wife of an Egyptian who... No! <laughs> saw that, God? Excuse me, I'm the local jailer. And you, sir, are in big trouble, son. The only way you're going to get out of here is Pharaoh himself comes to get you. Excuse me, I am a Pharaoh. Anyone here interprets dreams? <laughs> me? <laughs> Splendid. And while you're at it, would you mind terribly being governor of Egypt? <laughs> the stories I've told you are but a few, but read for yourself to see if they're true. Now it's time for me to say I do, because my five minutes here is through. <laughs>